Did you know that you can share your Amazon Prime benefits with a friend or family member? Let me show you how. Hello and welcome to DFM TV. I am Dan the Fire Stick Man. And on today's video, I am going to show you how to share your Amazon Prime benefits with a friend or family member. I will show you how to do it on your cell phone, your tablet, and your computer. Before we get started, I'd like to answer the most frequently asked questions. Why would I want to share my Amazon Prime membership with a friend or family? Well, most of us get Amazon Prime because of our shopping within Amazon. We get the free shipping. It just happens to be that we also get some extra perks by being a Prime member like Prime Video, Prime Music, Kendall, Amazon Kids, Twitch, those are some of the features that you get. You get quite a bit. So you may have a friend or family member that does not do a lot of shopping at Amazon. Maybe every once in a blue moon. But they would like to take advantage of the free shipping. Well, you can share your free shipping um, benefits with them and it won't cost you one more penny than what you're already paying for your Prime membership. They won't have to pay for Prime. They still get part uh, they still get to take advantage of all the benefits that Prime offers. Now another question that I get asked, if I share my Prime benefits with somebody, do they have access to my account? Do they have access to my wallet, you know, my credit cards on on Amazon? Uh, can they shop and use my credit card? These are all questions that I get asked. And the answer is yes and no. The reason is because you have the option whether or not you want to share your Amazon wallet with them. Now, you can share all the other benefits of Prime Video, Music, everything else, and you don't have to share your wallet, meaning that any order that they place with using uh, their account, it will be under their credit card. They won't see your shopping cart because we are going to be linking their Amazon account to yours. So they're going to piggyback off of your account and only take advantage of the benefits that you allow them to take advantage of. So them seeing your account in your in your purchase history or your orders or your access to your credit cards, it's not something they'll be able to see unless you allow it when you start the sharing process with this particular friend or family member. So it's something to be looking out for you for as you go through the sharing process, as you're filling out the information that needs to be filled out in order for your friend and family to share. Now here's the other thing. This is a must that you must have. You have your Amazon Prime account, which is great, and you're ready to share with somebody that you care for. That person already needs to have an Amazon account. They don't have to have an Amazon Prime because you're going to share your benefits. So obviously, they don't have to have an Amazon Prime, just an Amazon free account. They have that. They have to have that already established in order for this to work. This procedure that I'm going to show you is not going to create an Amazon account for this person if they don't have one. This is actually not going to work if they don't already have one. So they need to already have one. And if they don't know if they had one, you just ask the person, have you ever purchased anything from Amazon in the past? And I mean ever in your lifetime. If the answer is yes, maybe once 10 years ago, then they have an Amazon account. They just need to locate the email address that they use. Or if they try to start a new one and there's already one registered to that email, the Amazon website will let you know. You call them, they'll reset the password, and then you're good to go and you need to have that established before you follow the steps on this video. Now that said, and that being established, some of the things that the person can benefit from um, among the free shipping are, for instance, as you can see here, it'll be Twitch, Amazon Kits, Prime Video, Amazon Music, Kindle, and that's just to name a few. Okay, and the reason I'm talking about it is because Prime Video is a great feature to share with somebody. If you're already paying for Prime and they want to share the Prime Videos too, this is a great thing to have on their Fire Stick. And by you sharing that, you don't have to log in your account to their Fire Stick. They can still keep their account on their Fire Stick and those Prime benefits will just pop up on their Fire Stick and they'll be able to see all the Prime Video content that you get for free, they'll be able to get for free as well. So this next part of the video here, I'm going to show you how to do it on your cell phone and your tablet. The next part is going to be your PC. Okay, for this method, we're going to be focusing on the Amazon shopping application that you see here. Now, you can do this on any Apple device or any 
Android device. It doesn't matter if it's an iPhone, a tablet, it doesn't matter if it's an LG device, anything that's out there that's portable, you'll be able to do this method on as long as you have the Amazon shopping application. Now you can also do it using any of these devices with any web browser, but if you're gonna be doing it that way, you need to look at the second part of this video where I show you how to do it on a PC because it will look just like the PC version. Right now, we're gonna focus on using the Amazon shopping application. So let's go ahead and click on that. Once you do, it's gonna take you to your Amazon account. What we wanna focus on is these three lines on the upper left-hand side. Let's go ahead and click on that. Once you click on it, you wanna look for the one that says your account. Once you find it, you're gonna go ahead and click on that. And once you're here, the tab that we're looking for is going to be under your account settings. So once you see the account settings, I want you to scroll up just a little bit where you can bring it up to the top there. And you'll notice that there's one that says manage your household. I want you to go ahead and click on that one. And here, it'll take you to this screen where you can add an adult, add a teen, or add a child. And if you want to know exactly what you be sharing by adding an adult, teen, or child, you can just scroll down and you'll get some information as you see here. Also, it'll show you more of the prime benefits that you can share. And you can click on those same options on the top, on the very bottom, where you can click on add an adult, add a teen, or add a child. At this point, let's go ahead and click on add an adult. And on the first tab here, you're going to put the name of the person that you're going to be sharing this with. On the second tab, you're going to put their email address. Now, it's very important, as I mentioned in the beginning of this video, you need to make sure that they have an Amazon account and it's active. It does not have to be a Prime. You just create a free Amazon account and then you put that email address that they use for that Amazon account here after it's been created. This would not create an Amazon account just because you're putting their information on there. That's not how it works. So once you put that information there, you're going to hit continue and then you're going to go ahead and follow the prompts from there. Remember that you will have the option to share or not share your wallet. And I'll mention that on the second part of this video where I'm going to show you how to do it on a PC or if you're going to use a web browser on any of your portable devices to get this process done. Let's go to that part. All right, guys, so excuse my crazy looking wallpaper, but all you have to do is go ahead and click on a web browser, whether it's Google Chrome or whatever else you're using. And what you want to do is you want to go to the URL up here and you want to type in Amazon.com. Now, I already have a bookmark, so I'm going to click on my, my bookmark, but you're going to type in Amazon.com, and it's going to take you to your Amazon page. Um, if you're not logged in, then at this point is where you log in in order to see this page like this, and you know you're logged in because up here, it'll say your name, hello, and your name, and what you want to do is, once you're logged in, you want to just put the mouse over your name. You don't have to click on it. Just put your mouse over your name. You'll get these options, and you want to click on your account. Once you're in this screen here, on your account screen that you see here, what you want to do is you want to go down, and the one that we're looking for is the one that says Amazon Household that I just highlighted right there. I want you to click on that, and it's going to take you to this screen here where you can click Add Adult, Add Teen, or Add Child, or if you like to read over exactly what you'll be sharing, you can look at uh, the information that Amazon provides you down here and down here and you can also click on add adult add teen add child down here so either on the top or on the bottom here and then you're gonna click on add adult you're gonna put the name of the adult right here and then on the second line you're gonna put their email address once you put their name and their email address make sure it's the correct email address you hit continue and you wanna follow the prompts from there remember I'll repeat this again that you will have an option to share your wallet or not to share your wallet. At that point, you'll make that decision 
and you can go from there and that's how you do it on a PC okay great guys now you guys saw how you can do it on your phone and on your PC now you are set make sure that you go through the prompts and don't share your wallet if you don't want to I want to thank you guys so much for watching if you can just take a moment right now to subscribe to my channel like this video and ring that bell notification so you get notified every time I post a new video thank you so much for watching I am Dan the fire stick man until the next video happy streaming